what is up you guys, GribzyDTD here bringing you guys a brand new video and today I'll be talking about how Xbox joins PS4 and PC. Now, I couldn't fit it in the title because it's Xbox and it's just a program that I use called Upload Studio. But to get further into the point, Xbox gamers are now going to be able to hang out with PS4 people and PC players. So Microsoft has just announced like a big new feature on for Xbox owners across network play which Xbox players can now actually play with. PS4 players and PC players, so I wonder if they'll actually like add in like where we can actually talk to people on the PS4. I think that'd be an awesome feature, and I hope it gets done real soon. Like I don't know if PS4 really wants to join our networks, and I do see some major issues with that actually being part of the cause, such as if you actually think about it, PS4 and Xbox servers are always on their own server. They're not combined to play just on BM1 server, so. Coming with that, if one server goes down, then all of them go down. If you think about it, then what do we do from there? Now, are they going to have a backup server is what I'm going to be questioning. Is there going to be like a backup server that there's going to be? So if one falls down, is there going to be one just for like Xbox? And is there going to be just an independent one back up for PS4? Or are they going to just have another one and they're going to pay for another server but play on the main one until unless that one gets taken down by, I don't know, let's say Lizard Squad? But if that one gets taken down, do you think that there's going to be another server to play on? Now, that is probably one of the biggest things I have just thought of. And I don't know if they have really thought this clearly. Through clearly, I'm sorry. But I don't know if I like this. Like, yes, I do have a lot of friends that play on PS4. And most of my friends that I actually do play with in real life are also on Xbox One. So, to me, it really I guess it really doesn't matter which console they play on. I mean, if you guys think about it, the only difference between the Xbox One and the PS4 is that Xbox One, yeah, pretty much don't have as good as graphics, but certain download speeds are actually a little bit faster. And the only thing with the PS4 is, like I said, just better graphics. And that's basically the only difference between them. Now, I don't know if you guys like this, and if you guys are a PS4 player or Xbox One player, it really doesn't matter anymore, I guess. I mean, basically, they're saying that the consoles are the same and might as well split up for to make the difference and just be the same console. I think that's what they're pretty much saying to me, if you ask me. Now, if I was PS4, would I decline it or say yes to it? I think they actually did accept it already, so I guess that I'm a little invalid on this point. It doesn't really matter. Uh, I'll leave what you guys think in the comment below. I would like to see what you guys think about PS4 and Xbox and PC all being able to play on one network. So if so, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. DTD. Peace.